Welcome back to the Healthy Mind Developer. If you've ever found yourself stuck in a cycle of making bad decisions, you're not alone. Today we're going to explore strategies to break free from that cycle and make more informed choices. Making bad decisions can be frustrating and disheartening, but the good news is that there are steps you can take to turn things around. So let's jump into our guide on how to stop making bad decisions. Step one, reflect on patterns. The first step is to reflect on your decision-making patterns. Identify recurring themes or situations where you tend to make poor choices. Are there specific triggers or emotions that influence your decisions? Understanding these patterns is crucial for making positive changes. Step two, slow down. Often bad decisions stem from impulsive actions. Practice slowing down and taking a moment to think before making choices. This could mean counting to 10, taking a deep breath, or even stepping away from the situation. Slowing down allows your rational mind to catch up with your emotions. Step three, gather information. To make informed decisions, gather as much relevant information as possible. This might involve research, seeking advice from others, or simply taking the time to assess the situation objectively. The more information you have, the better equipped you'll be to make a sound choice. Step four, consider long-term consequences. Think beyond the immediate gratification or relief a decision might bring. Consider the long-term consequences of your actions. Will this choice align with your goals and values in the bigger picture? This perspective can help you prioritize wisely. Step five, seek input from others. Don't be afraid to seek input from trusted friends, family, or mentors. Sometimes an outside perspective can offer valuable insights that you might not have considered. Surrounding yourself with a supportive network can significantly impact your decision-making process. And there you have it, a comprehensive guide on how to stop making bad decisions. Remember, change takes time, so be patient with yourself as you implement these strategies. If you found this video helpful, let us know in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe for more content.